Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh to all those who take out the time to pass through these statuses and when it comes to the questions to mention how they felt they progressed during the last three months and there were those who went a step further who wrote out what they would do differently if they were given 30 days to prepare for a similar event may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward you all grant you all goodness grant you all the ability to visit Mecca and Medina and grant us all al firdaus al a'la the highest part of Jannah without any punishment or reckoning Amin. One of the most interesting answers I got when it came to the question how do you feel your progress has been during the last three months with the current crisis and somebody just wrote Alhamdulillah that was one of the most interesting answers I found May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us all the ability to be able to praise Him and say Alhamdulillah at all times, times of ease, times of difficulty. And that is the life of a believer. Whether he is going through difficulty, whether he is going through uh, hardship or ease, he praises Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala at all times. And one of the most interesting answers when it came to the question, if you were given 30 days to prepare for something similar, what would you have done differently? And I think one of the most interesting answers was where somebody said, I would build a prayer room in my house so we as a family can pray together. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant you goodness and all those who are listening. Ameen. Something interesting to mention when it comes to the question that we asked. If you were given 30 days to prepare for a similar event, what would you have done differently? I think there's two benefits to take from there. The first is that so many times we don't realize that we go through certain situations more than once in life. So when you go through it the first time and you've got some lessons, try and implement them, try and learn. So if this thing had to happen again, something similar, doesn't have to be something major like this, then you already prepared a little bit at least. The second lesson we can take is not everything in life has a second chance where you can get back to it and do it again and prepare for it. And one of those things is life itself. After you've died, there's no second chance. There's no coming back to this world. So try your best to do as much good as you can and uh, try your best. Make dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ask Him to grant you goodness. And with that, we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to grant us all goodness and make us from those who are able to carry out good deeds and do that which is pleasing to Him. Amin.